Hi everyone, David here with my late war German company, 1,650 point uh, infantry platoon, excuse me there. So, you've seen this before, but it's slightly different here. Everything is pretty well the same. The company headquarters with the mortar section and the anti-tank section. Three infantry platoons, the third platoon being the pioneers. I've got my anti-tank platoon of the pack 40s. I've got my mortar platoon, eight centimeter mortars with two spotters. I have my two heavy machine gun platoons. I have my stroke three platoon, as you can see right here. The big difference right there, the cats. I've got two SS Panzer Division Tigers that can come on uh, in part of my force now. These guys are fearless veterans and everybody else confident trained. So my concept of employment is pretty well the same as I had it before but what I'm going to do here is take a pause and organize these guys down how I can see them being employed in a defensive battle for example in hold the line. And here we are. So basically as you look at the forces here I see what's over here on the left being as those that started on the table. Assuming that for the scenario, I can only have half on the table at, a, at the start. And over here, I have the other five platoons that are going to come in in uh, reserves, other delayed reserves or whatever the scenario may call for. So, first of all, what's on the table? Before I get to that, i got to talk about this conglomeration here. This, under my company 2IC, is a Kampfgruppe of two pioneer section, or stands two infantry stands, an any tank section, and a heavy machine gun section. What I've done over here is I have a full infantry platoon of six stands, plus attached to it a heavy machine gun platoon. And the rest are pretty well untouched. Over here, I have the any tank platoon, pack 40s, the mortar platoon, again, I've got some support right off the start. Also, you notice I have the Tigers. Why would I have the Tigers on start and not have a mobile force that can come on as reserves? Well, from my own experience, Tigers attract a lot of attention. They force the enemy away from him, they cause all sorts of things to come at him, and what that does, for me, as a German defender, is allow my forces to dig in if they're not already done so. But also, I could even keep these guys in ambush and keep the guy wondering where my Tigers are. Failing that, depending on the scenario and the enemy force, I could have my pack 40s in ambush. The reserves. Coming over here, you can see I do have some mobile reserves. The Stoke 3 is able to come in. I have two more infantry platoons. Again, four stands of infantry, heavy machine guns, and the platoon commander. The pioneers laid out pretty well the same. And then the back, the two heavy machine gun platoons now down to two stands each plus their headquarters. So, that is my German 1,650 point uh, late war infantry company. I look forward to your comments. Thanks.